Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial. My name is William. In today's tutorial, I would like us to look at how to be able to use the slug instead of ID when returning maybe our posts or something of that sort. So in this case, um, we have a database here which has uh, blog posts. In this case, we have a title, body and slug. And uh, so if we are to return these uh, values by ID, we can be able to maybe just have a, a, a route here and we can say root get. In this case, we can say posts. And since we are interested in returning only the individual post, since we are interested in returning the individual post, then we are we are going to uh, just uh, get it in this format and maybe I will just work with it here in the model so we can have a function and then uh, inside here we can be able to pass the post a value, value using root model binding like that and then after that we can just say return post like that so return post so we have a post model and uh, so we will actually import it above here so we are going to import the model by just writing use app models and then post that is the name of the model that we will be working with in this case. So let us go ahead and see if we can uh, be in a position to uh, load our posts. So uh, our application is running at localhost 8000. So we can attempt and, and see. Yes, it is running here and I have uh, maybe done a little bit of too much zooming. So let me just reduce this to 100, like that. Yes, so that is our, our website. And in this case, I want us to visit posts. And then I want to pass the ID, in this case, the post with an ID of 1. And so you can see we are returning a JSON uh, data with uh, the post and every other detail of that specific post. Now suppose we want to change and return uh, this post not with using the ID but using any other column that we want in our uh, database. So in this case I would like us to use the slug which we have here, the slug of uh, these posts and what we are going to do we are going to go to our models and overwrite we're going to go to our models and overwrite. Um, we're going to go to our models and overwrite uh, the get root key name, uh, which uh, in this case has been set to the to using the ID, and then that will assist us to be able to load this value with another column so in this case the column that we want to work with is uh, the slug so we are going to put return slug like that so uh, and then uh, we will uh, save now going back to our web.php we are going to our routes folder where we have a uh, been returning our post, or in this case the the post with an ID of one. I will change what we have here, and here I'm going to just put post and put a full colon and write slug where we are returning it. So again, if I now go and get the slug maybe from the database, so I'll just pick one of the from one of the values that we have here. From one of the values that we have here, I'm going to copy it. And instead of using now one, I'm going to paste in the slug. As you can see, again, it is still returning our uh, blog post. So in this case, um, 
that is the end of this tutorial thank you very much for following up until this moment i ask that you may subscribe that you may comment that you may share this video such that um, you can be able to reach more thank you very much